force on a current carrying conductor. A force will act on a current carrying conductor when it is placed in a magnetic field. The force is due to the combination of the magnetic field of current carrying conductor and external magnetic field. This effect is also known as the motor effect. The effect of the force on a current carrying conductor in a magnetic field can be demonstrated using the apparatus shown in the diagram. The copper wire will move towards the right hand side when the switch is turned on. This shows that a force acts on the current carrying copper wire when it is placed in a magnetic field. If the current flowing through the copper wire is reversed, the copper wire will to left hand side. This shows that the force that acts on the wire also depends on the direction of the current. If polarities of the magnets are reversed, the copper wire will move to left hand side when the switch is turned on. This shows that the force that acts on the wire depends on the direction of the magnetic field. The direction of movement of a current carrying wire in a magnetic field can be determined using Fleming's left hand rule. By arranging left hand as shown in the image, the thumb and the first two fingers on the left hand are held at right angles to each other. The first finger points in the direction of the magnetic field from north to south. The second finger in the direction of the current, from positive to negative. The thumb points in the direction of the force, or the movement of the wire. The summary below aids in memorizing the rule. The following example shows how Fleming's left hand rule is used to predict the direction of the force that acts on a current carrying conductor in a magnetic field. By arranging your left hand as shown in the image, the first finger points in the direction of the magnetic field from north to south. The hand is then rotated until the second finger points in the direction of the current from positive to negative. The thumb then points in the direction of the movement of the wire. Combined magnetic field due to the current carrying conductor in a magnetic field. Figure shows the magnetic field between the poles of a magnet and the magnetic field due to a current carrying conductor before they are combined. When a current carrying conductor is placed in a magnetic field, a resultant magnetic field is produced. Above the conductor, the magnetic field lines of the magnet and the conductor are in same direction. This pattern results in a stronger magnetic field above the conductor. Below the conductor, the magnetic field line of the magnet and the conductor are in the opposite direction. This pattern results in a weaker magnetic field below the conductor. The stronger magnetic field above the conductor will result in a downward force that acts on the conductor. The action of the combined magnetic field known as the catapult field. Thank you for taking time to watch this.